Hi guys, it's Colin from Magic Park Hoppers and today we are in my kitchen slash dining table because we are gonna try some delicious Halloween treats from Disneyland and oh my goodness, I'm so excited because we have a lot to try, okay? All right, you guys, so Zero here is gonna accompany me trying out the most delicious treats from Disneyland. But yeah, um, so yesterday we went to Disneyland, but sadly we couldn't do a full day because David had to go to work the next day. We had to go pretty early, so we had to leave super early too. So what we did is we just got us a bunch of treats so we can try it at home, right? So let's get started because just talking about all these treats is making me salivate. <laughs> okay, so we're gonna start with this Cruella brownie. Um, yeah, it's a brownie. Let me look. Oh, assuming it's chocolate and white chocolate, but I am not sure. So we're gonna see what this is. Okay. Okay. Okay, so this Cruella brownie right here is from Jolly Holiday and this one is a dark and white chocolate mousse brownie. It's a chocolate brownie with black and white chocolate mousse and this one is $5.49. I mean, she looks pretty rough right now because it's from yesterday, but this. <laughs> I'm excited. The whole thing is coming out. Focus, focus. Oh my god, it's not focusing. It's not focusing. Oh my god. See, come on, come on, ma'am. Can you focus? It's not focusing, but okay, I'm right here. Oh my goodness. That is some good brownie. I wonder how would it would taste like if I had tried this yesterday because, you know, it's fresh and new. I mean, it, it would still be in the refrigerator, so. But, oh my goodness. Mm-mm-mm. Good. It's a little bit hardish now. But not too hard because it's been sitting in the fridge. Let me get some water. Okay, so the brownie kind of hardened a little bit already because it's been sitting in the fridge all night. Um, but it's still good. Um, the mousse is so fluffy and light. Uh, it's just so good. I wish you guys could taste this. Um, I want to get some more, but I need to save some for David. And I need to share with uh, Manila later too. So we're going to save you for later because uh, you're so good. Okay, so up next we have this mummy wand right here oh my goodness cuteness overload can you see that it's so freaking cute so i got this one from the candy palace for 5.99 um i don't know what else to tell you this is so freaking cute okay i'm so sorry mommy but i'll have to eat you because <laughs> Let's just try this. It's an, it's an M and M. So over here, it's a marshmallow, and then you have caramel on surrounding the marshmallow, and then it's dipped in white chocolate right here. So it's so good. Although I would say. The original is still my favorite, the chocolate um, dip. It's a marshmallow wand dip in chocolate, in milk chocolate. That one is my favorite, you guys. This one is still good, but that one is my favorite. Okay, up next we have this Jack Skellington cake pop. <gasps> yeah. I don't know why I have to make that sound, but I'm just so excited with all these treats. Um, so this is a cake pop. I believe, I'm just, I couldn't find the description online right now um, but I'm assuming this is just dipped in white chocolate I'm not so sure what's on the inside so let's let's get into it okay mmm just your regular like cake pop vanilla cake pop 
or is that what you would just say? Vanilla, vanilla cake. And it's dipped in white chocolate with some, you know, Jack Skellington face. It's just so cute. Okay, I want to bite, I'm gonna bite a little bit more. I'm gonna have to save this for Manila and I'm just gonna bite the back that way she could see the face mm -mm -mm. we have a couple more let me drink some water okay let's, let's continue <laughs> okay up next we have this rice crispy treat and it is the Minnie Mouse which it's just your regular um well it's not regular okay it's a special rice crispy so it's your regular rice crispy right there and they dip it in um what do they dip it in they dip it in um chocolate and it has your mini hat witch witch hat <laughs> and then you have your buttons right here <laughs> buttons <laughs> it's so cute okay Just bite into this. Mmm. That's chocolate. That's chocolate. It's good. Mmm. 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 If I try by itself, it's okay. It's kind of dry. But with the chocolate and everything, it's so good. It just complements each other. But by itself, like the back side, it's a little bit dry. Okay. Next, I don't have the the whole thing anymore because it broke. Okay, it broke. It's what it looks like in the picture. It's so pretty and so cute. It's actually huge too. And um, so when we got home yesterday, when we found out it broke, we're just like, okay, we're just gonna try it. Let me tell you guys, this cookie is one of the best cookies I've ever tried. Actually, all of the sugar cookies taste the same. Like. How can I explain it? It's not too sweet. I'm just, let me take a bite, okay? Mm. It's not your average like sugar cookie you, you buy in Vons or Ralph's. Like those cookies are way too sweet even without the icing. With this cookie, it's not too sweet. It's just good, it's just right, okay? Not too bland, not too sweet. It's just right in the middle. Plus like the frosting on top. It makes it a little bit sweeter so it's not too too sweet unlike you know the store-bought cookies but like the cookies by itself in the bottom is already sweet plus that frosting on top it's just way too sweet but this one is just perfect mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. <sighs> okay last but not least we have this poison apple apple candy candy apple it's gorgeous here we have your granny smith apple dipped in caramel with confectioner's coating fancy okay how am i gonna bite into this should i cut this maybe i i'll bite into it i'll try to bite into it and then we'll cut it later <sighs> Let me see if it doesn't break my teeth or my tooth. Let's see. I can't. That is delicious. Okay, I got cut off. I don't know what happened. But this apple is delicious. The Granny Smith um, apple is so tart. Not too tart. It complements the the coating because the coating is a little bit too sweet but when you pair it with the granny smith apple it's just so good it's perfect you know i'm gonna cut that out and we're gonna eat that okay let's talk about my favorite from all these treats i brought home you guys ready the corolla corolla is my favorite Corolla is my favorite treat from all of these I've tried because I can't I promise this is gonna be my last bite because I'm saving it for David okay 
It's just so good. Mm -mm. The brownie and the mousse, it's just so perfect. The mousse is not too sweet on top, it's light and fluffy. It just melts in your mouth, it's so good. Um, I would say my second favorite would be the Granny Smith apple. <laughs> it's just so good because like I said, the combination of the tart apple, not too tart, just the tartness of it and the sweetness of the coating, it just complements well with each other. And yeah, my third favorite would be the sugar cookies. No, it's just I like it. It's not too sweet. Mm -hmm. As for the other three, they are good. It's just I feel like it's way too sweet for me that I won't be able to finish the whole treat. They're fun, they're cute, they're very Instagrammable, but it's just not my top three, okay? They're they're good with like one or two bites, but not enough for me to finish the whole thing. I would have to um share it with David or Manila. <laughs> Alright you guys, that is it for today's video and I know it's super short but I promise a lot more content will be coming out soon. Um, as always, thank you guys so much for watching and don't forget to give this video a thumbs up. Only if you want to. I'm not really forcing you. If you want. Also, don't forget to follow us on Instagram at Magic Park Hopper. Only without the S. I don't know, I'm gonna fix that soon, okay? At Magic Park Hoppers. Why do I keep saying hoppers? Because I'm used to park hoppers. At Magic Park Hopper on Instagram. And I'll see you guys later. Okay, bye.